over in Katina State, farmers have raised alarm over what they described as widespread infestation of strange insects and worms in their farms. Text by Trust TV and some farms reveal that the tiny straight insects and worms are significantly destroying crops in areas where there is shortage of rainfall. Abdullah Yamadi tells us more. Farmers in local government areas of northern Katsina such as Keita, Jibia, Basari, Mayadwa, Mashi, Bindawa, Charanchi, Rimi, Katsina and Batagarawa among those experiencing partial shortage of rainfall running into its third week. Majority of crops here, which are almost three weeks old, are drying up gradually and attracting worms and other insects that thrive with shortage of rain. Farmers here who are afraid of the unknown are praying for rainfall and support from the government to assist with insecticides to enable them get rid of the pest. My name is Muhammad Lawal Adamun Shankafi, Kazina Local Government. The worms are destroying crops such as maize, millet and corn. We are appealing to the state government to intervene in the area of spraying pesticides on the affected areas to reduce the impact of the worms. Government support will complement our efforts of getting rid of the strange insects. I am Yahya Abdullahi. The insects and worms are very destructive. They have destroyed some of our farms completely at a time when farmers are facing serious difficulties. Our plan is to either transplant or make plant all over again when the rains return. Kindly inform authorities concerned about our constraints. Residents say if the drought persists, thousands of farmers across the affected local government areas risk losing their crops, a situation that may further aggravate food insecurity, not only in Kazama State, but Nigeria as a whole. Though the insects and worms were noticed by farmers some few weeks ago, the Kazanian state government through the Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Agriculture and Natural Resources, Mohammed Mohammed, assured that extension workers have since been dispatched to spray pesticides on the affected farms to prevent an escalation. Now, more than ever before, experts and other public commentators are saying the situation requires a holistic approach by the government and other stakeholders before it gets out of control. Abdullahi Ismayamadi, Trust Television News, Kazanah.